Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a haul video, yeah. And this is probably one of the most requested haul videos that I get. And it is to do a Makeup Revolution haul. Just a slight disclaimer, some of the stuff was sent to me and some of it I bought with my own moolah. So I'm gonna go and unbox this or take this out. I bought all of this actually with my own money, so I'll show you that first. And I can't remember what I got. And I opened it just to make sure everything was okay. And then I seen it was all bubble wrapped because it's always very securely packaged so when I saw that it was all bubble wrapped I was like oh I just presume everything's fine so I can't rightly remember everything I got but the first thing I do see I do remember purchasing this and this is the ultra professional contour palette and I was super excited to try this out it is a contour palette look how pretty that looks so I'm so into my contour palettes at the moment. I am just all about that contour life. I just think that this was super amazing for the price. I think this was about 11 euro. Not only do you get contours, shades, and matte like highlighting powders or setting powders, but you also get two shimmery highlight powders for the tops of your cheekbones and wherever you want to put them. So they're quite pretty. So that's what those two powders look like. This one is obviously a lot more shimmery than this one. This, this is actually coming off quite satin. We'll maybe do a blog post on this, perhaps doing the full swatches and everything. So the next thing I got was three lipsticks. I've never tried these lipsticks, but I hear great things about them. Maybe if I like them enough, I might get the rest of the range and do a lip swatch video. So the first one I got was absolutely flawless. Absolutely flawless. Simply Flawless, what the hell is that song? It's just a really nice, I'm gonna say brownie nude -y. That is just the worst description ever. Yeah, it's like a brown nude. I was right. Uh -huh. That's that one, absolutely flawless. And the next one is called Looking Ahead. And I was really interested in this one. It's kind of like a deep brown with a little bit of plum in it. I think this would be great for people who want to venture into like the darker lip side, but they don't want to go too full on. This one would be really nice. It reminds me a little bit of Max Plum Full as well, if anybody has ever tried that. And the final lipstick color I got was You're a Star. This is just like straight up nude. This is a pretty nice color as well. There's a slight bit of pink to that as well, which I quite like. The next thing I got was one of the ultra brow tints. I've actually gone through one of these in my life and I got a light color, but I got the medium shade this time, which I think is going to suit my brows a little bit better. Right now on my brows, I have a NYX brow gel and it's just a little bit too dark. This is kind of a chocolate color, but it's not too, too dark. It's actually lighter than the one that I'm using on my brows at the moment. So I can't wait to try this out. I'm going to get the lighter color again because I really, really enjoyed it. I love the way it sets your eyebrows in place. It doesn't dry them out or make them look really severe either. So I really like that brow gel and that's in the color medium and it's their aqua brow tint. And the final thing that I bought was the Revolution Awesome Metals Foil Finish. And this is the pure platinum one. Ooh. And I know you get a little dish, a solution and everything. You can mix it up. It's supposed to be like the Stila Magnificent Metals and I think they're quite similar. So that's what that looks like. It's just this gorgeous silver color. I'm sure you will see this on my channel coming up to Christmas. Wow, like look at that for pigmentation. Ah. Now these next few items were sent to me and I want to just say a huge thank you to Makeup Revolution for sending them out and I just, I absolutely adore them. So next I have the Goddess of Faith and this is a triple baked highlighter. Triple baked, what have ya. So this is a heart shaped highlighter. Kind of similar packaging to the Too Faced blushes. That's what the Too Faced blushes look like and that's what the Makeup Revolution. So they're pretty similar in packaging. This is a highlighter and obviously I know that Too Faced don't do a highlighting version of this. And I have my eye on this for the longest time ever. I'm running out of places to swatch so I'm going to swatch it up here. So that's it there. It's so pretty. I just can't wait to use this as a highlighter. And I think the packaging is so cute. I love it so much. Makeup Revolution always do a great job with their packaging. The next thing then is the lip lavas and I'm dying to try this. This is in the color Forgiven. Again, it's supposed to be similar like the Too Faced melted, whatever the hell they're called, the melted lipstick things. And similar to the LA Girl lip lacquer Yoki Mabobs that they have. It's the same kind of idea. It comes in a tubey, squeezy tube. So it's really pigmented. It is nude, like it's not a straight up nude. Let's put this a bit of this on. 
Ooh, and there's vitamin E in that. Great. So that's going to like moisturize and pair my lips, hopefully. And then the last two things that I got were the most exciting things ever. And it's the iHeart Makeup Chocolate Bar Palettes. Now, I was really not expecting this. I thought this was a really, really kind gift for them to give me. And this is the Salted Caramel one, which is supposed to be like the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Salted Caramel Palette. And then the other one I got is the iHeart Chocolate Pink Fizz, which is a pink chocolate bar. So that's what it looks like on the inside. That's what it looks like. And this is so strange, but it actually has a really sweet smell off it. I don't know if that's a purposeful thing. I'm presuming it is. But the colors in this are so beautiful. They're so nude and pink. But then you have this like dark chocolate color in here and then a bright blue and a purple. So there is a bit of versatility with this palette. I'm loving the color up here, which is called Toast. And this one here, which is called Girl. I'm really loving that one too. There is only two matte shadows in that palette. And I like a bit of matte and a bit of shimmer going on on my lid. So I'm so pleased with that palette. And I just think it's so cute. A pink chocolate bar. Hello. So that's what this palette looks like. So obviously it's, it's dark chocolate and then it's caramel melting on top and I'm so obsessed. Hang on. Ugh. And this is what it looks like on the inside. So like I said, it's quite similar to the chocolate bar salted caramel palette. So the colors that I already am loving is this color here, which is called sweet. This one here in the end, which is called salted. I'm loving this kind of brownie, what do you call caramel? I would have to do a look with this palette because I just think it is so pretty. I'm just so obsessed with it. If any of you have ever tried Makeup Revolution, you would know they're super pigmented. I just absolutely am so obsessed with this palette and I cannot wait to start doing tutorials with it. If you guys would like to see a look with anything that I have today, please let me know because I'm so excited about Makeup Revolution. I'm regularly buying from Makeup Revolution. I do absolutely love the brand, so I get so excited when the stuff comes through the door. And if there's anything that you would recommend for Makeup Revolution that maybe that I haven't tried already, please let me know down below. So for now, guys, thank you so much for watching and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy Makeup Revolution hauls and I will definitely do more in the future. I'm always buying from them. And I will talk to you in my next video, guys. I love you all so much. Much.